all know that exposed services are low-hanging fruit for the bad guys. Vulnerable services represent a huge problem to security groups trying to keep pace with cloud sprawl, grey market IT, and good old-fashioned oversights from overworked team members. I'm going to run a search across the entire internet for exposed telnet on port 23. Really nice, simple syntax to search nearly 2,000 available data fields. Services equals telnet. Well over 3 million hits. Fascinating and academically interesting, but as a threat hunter or governance specialist, I can narrow this search down further. Let's look for exposed telnet that has words like username in the banner. I can connect these searches using simple Boolean logic. Wow, there's still 600,000 of those. But I know my build protocols. My machines don't have phrases like username. They have the exact phrase username. So let's change the syntax of this query a little. We'll change our fuzzy colon designation here for an exact match equals. I can now see all assets on the internet with Telnet exposed with an exact match for username in the banner. There's still over 300 of these, so I can narrow down this search further based on my own IP range. Exposed Telnet with the exact phrase username and the class C network 27.120.1.0. Bingo. Five assets in a specific IP range with a vulnerable exposed service ready to be brute forced by an attacker. I can now explore these assets in much more detail and assign them to team members for remediation.